One type of song that has come into increasing prominence in recent months is the folk song of protest. You have to admire people who sing these songs. It takes a certain amount of courage to get up in a coffee house or a college auditorium and come out in favor of the things that everybody else in the audience is against, like peace and justice and brotherhood and so on. <laughs> but the nicest thing about a protest song is that it makes you feel so good. I have a song here which I realize should be accompanied on a folk instrument in which category the piano does not, alas, qualify. So imagine, if you will, that I am playing an 88-string guitar. <laughs> oh, we are the folk song army. Every one of us cares. We all hate poverty, war, and injustice, unlike the rest of you squares. There are innocuous folk songs, yeah, but we regard them with scorn. The folks who sing them have no social conscience, why, they don't even care if Jimmy crack corn. If you feel dissatisfaction, strum your frustrations away. Some people may prefer action, but give me a folk song any old day. The tune don't have to be clever, and it don't matter if you put a couple extra syllables into a line. It sounds more ethnic if it ain't good English, and it don't even gotta rhyme. Excuse me, rhyme. Remember the war against Franco, that's the kind where each of us belongs. Though he may have won all the battles, we had all the good songs. So join in the folk song army, guitars are the weapons we bring to the fight against poverty, war and injustice. Ready? Aim!